decided to play Jim's computer cause I saw it on TikTok. Enjoy. From a video I watched about this game, it said it was psychological. I'll leave the link to the video in the description if you want to check it out. In the game's normal phase, you just get packages and go to sleep, but Emma B stopped talking about the game and let you all enjoy. Not gonna lie, I was scared about this part, and I was playing it at night, which made it 10x scarier for me. That closet opening caught me off guard and made me jump real bad. I was on guard at that point forward, was still a little hesitant about opening the closets, but not that scared enough I wouldn't open it. I have mm, cheeseburgers. Mmm, mm, cheeseburgers. Mmm, mm, cheeseburgers. Mmm, mm, cheeseburgers.
This game had me scared as hell. I'm surprised I didn't leave the game cause if I wasn't recording I knew I would have left as soon as I heard the first knock. wouldn't be hesitant to go to that door bro. Playing this at night time was a bad idea.
Came had me searching in gamed and in real life. Decent jump scare, to be honest. Sped up it took me too long to figure out what to do. Ain't no way bro told me to be calm, how he trina snatch me up like groceries on Black Friday. Should have been someone in the closets it would make this game more intense, but it would increase the chance I would die of a heart attack playing Roblox. That alert had me shivering. I was ready to shoot someone, but didn't expect it to be myself. Well, that was a 11 out of 10 horror game in my opinion. No game had me that immersed into it. I must be getting more scared or the devs really did something with psychology in this game. It felt like the game was playing me instead of me playing the game. If you catch what I'm trying to throw. In short, the game really made me question when I was safe or about to get snatched like a 50% off shirt in the mall on Black Friday. Well, I hope you all enjoy and sigh in the next video.